can't do this anymore. Okay. So in this tutorial, I want to show you how to do the vertigo effect, which I'm sure that you, um, I'm sure that you've, you've, yeah. So I'm sure that you've seen the vertigo effect before. Uh, some people call it the Hitchcock zoom or the dolly zoom. Uh, basically, it just kind of looks like the scene kind of moves away from you, um, which is which is how I feel all the all the time. But um, yeah. Caleb, are you done with your homework? Yeah, I'm working on my homework. I'll be I'll be done in a minute. Okay. Okay, dinner soon. Yeah, I'll 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 set. The... God damn it. Um, so anyways. It turns out that we can do the vertigo effect in 3D. And here I modeled, you know, the, the house that I own. Uh, I'm a, the landlord here. Uh, live with my wife. Anyways, I, I modeled it. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm coming. Just give me a minute. Don't speak that tone with me. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah, I will be there in a minute. Okay, I'm just, I'm working on homework. <sighs> so I made this 3D scene and we can do the vertigo effect here. So. I'm gonna go into the camera, and the first thing we need to do is have the camera move forward. So I'm gonna add a keyframe, and then let's go to the last frame, move the camera. Caleb, last yeah, morning. I, I'm coming down. Just give me 30 seconds. You can count out loud. I'm gonna be no. <sighs> I'm coming. God fucking damn it. Excuse um, me? No. I'm I'm just doing homework. Can you just give me a minute? Thank you. I'm going to animate the camera moving forwards, which when we use linear interpolation, it, it looks like this. And this is what it would look like, you know, if let's say a friend came over to your house, this is what it, that's what it would look like. Um, any, what? Yeah. yeah. Is this door locked? Um, it's, your father can hear it's us. not, it's not locked. I'm, I'm working on homework. Huckleberry Finn essay. Dinner's ready. Okay, I'm coming. I am coming. I'm getting up. I'm leaving. Okay, I need to finish this up. Um, okay, so we, we have the camera moving in, and now we just need to do the focal length thing, which makes it look like the, the Hitchcock zoom. So I'm just going to keyframe the focal length. Go to the last frame, change it, but make sure that, you know, none of the background is exposed when want people knowing this is fake, right? You know, I do live here. I do own it. We're going to add a keyframe, linear interpolation, and look at that. Um, that's how you do the, the vertigo effect, the Hitchcock zoom. Caleb, uh, that is it. I, I... What was, what was on your screen? Nothing. No, what was that? Don't, don't touch... Why are you always doing these stupid videos? No one watches them, Caleb. No one. Come down to dinner right now.